Hi, and welcome back to the Mr. Brad Warden Show. And this is a challenge, an unofficial challenge, not a League of Fire challenge, but a challenge and one that I've never done before. This one kind of got lost in my stash a little bit. I probably got it like probably close to a year or less, a little less probably. It's called the Landmine. Take a look at that. It's pretty spooky. So the landmine, um, I'll show you some of the sides. So here, if you see this, you kind of know what's in it. Did he get that? The ghost peppers and Carolina Reapers. And maybe because it's not official challenge on the Scoville scale from Wooly Pete's, they just have it on the second to highest, which is still really hot. So it's a Wooly Pete's. It's the same company that makes some of the League of Fire challenges, like the Mole Bar, the uh, Raspberry Rain, Chili Cherry Nightmare, Nemesis Bar. And those are all the way up to the top, and I've done this. But I will not take this lightly because this also has Ghost Pepper and Reaper infused. It is a landmine peanut butter cup. It is the hottest peanut butter cup in the world. And possibly one of the biggest. I know they make big candies. But it is six ounces, nearly half a pound, of a huge, huge peanut butter cup. And... This one has been a little bit melted. Um, when I did some of the other bars from Wally Pete's, I took a little bit of guff because the bars were melted. But apparently when I got this one in that same order, notice it kind of got melted too. But because it's not an official challenge, it's not really going to matter. And the quantity, it's a sealed pack. It's still the same package. So this is the landmine on the official challenge. Even though it had been melted, it's still pretty much intact. There's not going to be a lot left. Yep. It's, even though you can see it's melted down here, it's still intact. There's not like loose. It was the sealed package. This is a landmine. It is huge. Regular peanut butter cups have been downsized. There are many of this one pretty much fills my whole hand here. I wish it didn't have Reaper in it. And it has Reaper and uh, I wish it was just Ghost regular. Pepper in it. Yeah. yeah, if this was just regular, a lot of people would be digging this. Yeah, but... they would be chowing it down. <laughs> but here we go. What I'm going to do, and I smell it. It smells like one of the standard Wooly Pete's chocolate bars. So it's going to be hot. It smells like the hot peppers, but it smells like chocolate too. And I'm going to eat. Am... Well, the peanut butter's inside. You can kind of see it throughout a little on the edges. I'm going to eat this um, probably as quickly as I can. Not going to intend to eating, and then I'm going to do a five minute afterburn just to uh, see. Usually, five minutes my heat usually builds and starts coming down, so we'll see what the heat level gets to. So, here we go the landmine. Eat over your package. <laughs> I always have to clean it up anyway, I'm a cam person, insists. So, not an official challenge, but definitely challenge worthy here. Show us what the peanut butter oh, oh it's like wow. a peanut butter cup. Oh, and I think it's coming right away. That's really thick. Mm-hmm. Tasty though. Like a peanut butter cup. It looks like a regular peanut butter cup. I can't really see the peppers in there. I can definitely taste it right away. I'm gonna see as I eat through it if I can see. Does it taste, it taste like, whether it's more in the chocolate does or it peanut taste butter? Like a Reese's peanut butter cup. Mm-hmm. It's a lot spicier. This is a lot spicier than our Reese's peanut butter cup. Oh yeah, that's probably spicier than the Reese's peanut butter The heat level's not super high yet. It's just gradually building the way these chocolate bars do. For some reason, that kind of looks like what's inside the butter finger. Let's see about I can't pinpoint really or yeah, see looks, where the pepper is, but yeah, it literally looks like they took it's the, definitely in there. Yeah, it literally looks like they took the peanut butter out of the butter finger and just stuffed it in. Very this chewy with bit. the peanut butter. <clears throat> Did, yeah, good. Delicious. 
you know, taste a lot of peanut butter. You can taste the chocolate. The hot pepper, I don't know if it's because my tolerance is high or just because it's not quite as much as maybe the other bars. It's not as overwhelming. But don't get me wrong, the heat's still there. This is um, definitely a 10 for an average person. My heat right now is probably about like a two. Four. Two only had. <clears throat> That's it. No, it's still kind of building a little bit. You know what heck stuff is nice, this holy bulb? Maybe we should have had some help for that. Well, that's probably why it's not. No, you know what? It's gallon. We are not eating some beef ham. This is like a snack for you. Mmm. Like a chili head snack, I mean. I thought it might be a little bit harder than this, but it's, it's hot. It's just not the blazing um, League of Fire challenge level. It's not like League of Fire worthy. Mm-hmm. That's probably why they didn't make an official challenge. Although, um, I could maybe get like a point or two or like, I don't know. Now that he's filming a little bit. I got something in the works to torture me, I think. <laughs> Which I don't know if I'm going to do that. No. I might be pushing like a uh, chili head three, maybe. Two to three. I wanted to see you sweat. Got a little higher. I wanted to see you sweat a little bit. Maybe like a poppy lung kick worthy. Or like that one taco challenge. Or maybe it's like worthy of like the taco challenge or something. Mm-hmm. Right. I think I'd give it probably about a three for chili head heat. At least for me. Some chili heads might worry a little bit higher. <clears throat> The burn solid. It does have less pepper and reaper. But tasty. Unofficial challenge. They were trying to punish me with some tincture, oh, but yes. ah, oh, here we go again. All right, little man of fire, do you want to start my timer for me? Um, no, 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 I'm not going to try this fight. Another awkward moment of me on the camera. All right, here we go. Ah, uh, okay. my timer, I'm going to do five minute afterburn. He's probably pretty solidly built by now. Um, yeah, I'd say I'd say a three is about what I'm at after eating the whole six ounce landmine. Hottest peanut butter cup that I'm aware of, and one of the largest too. After eating half a pound peanut butter cup. Close to half a pound, not quite eight ounces. Yeah. Would be half a pound. This one was six ounces. Well, now it's too late. I should have uh, added it on. Well, now you need... H-E double hockey stick hammer. You guys made me get this. I'm not doing a full Robbie, though, because... No, yes. sorry. No. Nope. I'm just... The burns... I mean, it's going to amp it up, and then this sitting in my stomach. I'll do a couple of drops about that. Well, it almost defeats the purpose. Well, I already did hit the high, highest burn. The beep? The It'll beep. just come down. I guess the afterburn will just. Or just wait till after the five minutes and then. Hey, the beep hammer kind of. I'm gonna make a difference like, now. The beep hammer kind of looks like it would be like an orangey flavor.
Okay. Yeah, no damage at all. See, the landmine's already down my throat and my stomach, and now the heat in my mouth had gone away, and now it's totally back after the itchy double hockey's to camera tincture that they made me do. Now, between the two, I mean, maybe my talent is higher. Usually, the HG double hockey stick camera puts me a little higher. Probably at maybe like a four. Maybe a bow to five. I was waiting for you to do. Now is not the day to do a full Robbie after a landmine. Not the day. I'm pretty crazy most of the time. But I'm not quite that crazy. D mm. to six ounce Reaper and Ghost Pepper and Fierce Peanut Butter Cup and a full Robbie of AG Double Hockey Stick Hammer Tincture. I'm not quite that crazy, folks. I know my camera person would love to see me, but my camera person would also me, probably see me in the bathroom at that rate. Well, now the heat from the landmine had already started to drop from that three. I did a tincture. It put me back up at about a four or five heat level. And uh, I don't know if that'll come down or not. Usually, when I do a tincture this hot, it usually sticks with me about 10 to 15 minutes. We'll see. Get like two or three drops just there. Camera person always tortures me. Why? So this is uh, the landmine from Willie Pete's. This is a veteran-owned company as well. I just did some veteran-owned soap companies before. Veteran-owned chocolate company. Willie Pete's is also the chocolate company that produces the um, Nemesis, Raspberry Rain, Mo Bar, Chili Cherry Nightmare, some of the other hottest chocolate treats league of fire challenges for chocolate that there are in the world um also they helped uh make the uh the uh experience i curry experience bar so a lot of them the landmine probably the hottest peanut butter cup in the world um put me into uh chili had three 10 for an average person. The hottest peanut butter cup in the world and the biggest peanut butter cup in the world. Well, I can't guarantee it's the biggest. They've been having businesses that oh, make yeah, big like and crazy Guinness stuff. World Records, like so I'm sure they probably have some bigger ones somewhere, but this is probably the hottest. Like the spice wise. biggest ice cream. Yeah. And then HE Double Hockey Stick Hammer, possibly. From what I know, maybe the hottest tincture there is, too. Get me a spoon. And we are going to leave before I become more tortured because my camera person is trying to torture me further. Get me a spoon. Ew. No, I wanna I'm not. I have a bonus round for the end. I'm not grabbing it for you. I'm going to no, try no. some Hellhammer. No. No. No, no. Why not? Well, you can, but you'll be destroyed. I just want one drop. You'll still okay. be this if you think so. Oh boy. Oh, you don't know what you're doing. This is like off the scale, like 100 for like yep. average person. Okay, there's your spoon. 100? How bad will it kill me? Um, intolerably bad. Put you in the toilet. Well, I throw well it won't make you sick. But. I don't know what you'll do. Water and milk won't help you, and you'll have 10 to 15 minutes of like Pain. H E double hockey stick in your mouth. Like, it'll literally be. If you want to know what H E double hockey stick the real is like, go ahead and try some of that. Like, guess what? Because nothing will save you. Like, this nothing is... will save your soul. Like, enough. this is worse than green sickle. Like, at least 10 times worse than Green Sickle. Uh -huh. 10 times worse? Mm -hmm. Yeah, than Green Sickle. So I bet she shit it. Do you want to go there? Hmm. 
He's thinking. Or do you People know? People at home, you can see my camera person in so much severe pain. Yeah. Maybe that. We'll All right, let's do it. She was thinking about it. Give me the camera. Whoa. Ladies and gentlemen, you get a treat today. There's the hammer. Didn't Pyro's wife do this? Yeah, so on drop. Did she? Did she survive it? Yeah, you'll survive it. You'll just wish you hadn't done it after the fact. Yeah. Is there any milk in the house? Yes, yeah, that's not going to help you. That's not going to help you at all. My heat's finally starting to come down have a little it? bit. Well, I still have I don't know if I want to do this. I'm starting, to have, I'm starting to have questions. Just do it. One small drop. Not too bad. Okay, that's enough. Okay, that's enough. Oh, that's a nice ice drop. Here we go. Here's... I don't know. Get ready for some good old-fashioned fun. I think I'll just do this. Just take the scoop. I touched a little to my tongue. Oh. Oh, you're. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> you wish you hadn't done that. And that's just a tick off the drop. Oh, baby. It's just to take off the drop and it'll burn it. Okay, I'm just kind of letting it go. Oh dear. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. I can't see you. Oh. Oh, I'm climbing. Okay. No. I may as well just no. take the rest of yeah. the drop. Take it. Go big or don't. Oh, oh, oh. Down it. That really is hot. Oh! Do it. Down it. Oh, that. Oh, it's really climbing. Oh. Oh. Okay. Mm, kumbaya. <laughs> well. <laughs> Oh, the throat. Oh, crap. Into my road. Oh, sorry. Hey, this family show here. Hey, sorry. Family. Chest. Family show. Family show. <coughs> oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, this is really hot. It is burning. Okay. <laughs> Didn't I even <sighs> going to do one single drop? <sighs> well, take the rest or don't now. Spread out, it looks brutal now. Breathe. <gasps> Breathe. 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 How are you breathing? Oh, I'm feeling dizzy. Don't do endorphin it. Endorphin crushing. Yeah, I'm an endorphin crush. Don't do it. That's what happened to me. Oh! Oh! <laughs> now, let's see some pain and suffering. The hammer. No, it is pain only. I'll feel you. Pain you feel. Mm -hmm. Yesterday I had a, I felt pain because you're in the turn of birds. He's gone to a different place. To a H E double hockey stick oh, place, probably. Oh, oh, this is not good. Oh no. Do you need oh, milk no. or not? Oh no. Need oh no. I know your tolerance no. has been going up, but this. My tolerance has really gone up. Oh no. Oh no. Can I have some oh, tissues no, to spit no, into? No, no, no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna look for some quickly. Like it hurts. This has been a bad mistake. A bad um, mistake. I don't see tissues. I'm, I'm getting something. I'm going to a bad mistake. I'm there. Don't touch me. Oh no. <laughs> Do you need napkins? Oh no. Uh -huh. Oh, oh no. I, I used up the rest of the toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
some true beep hammer pain and suffering. And that's one drop. This is the first time I've had to blow my nose. Don't worry, it got my nose kind of running too. But, oh no. This is what some good old fashioned HE double hockey stick hammer <laughs> tinctured us to a, an average person. Well, considering you've done a little tolerance building, you're a little bit higher than the average person now, and it's still that bad. Notre Dame said, I don't know. <laughs> Alright. Should we leave it or do you want to hang in there? A little bit longer. Little man of players jamming <laughs> out. Little man of players, you want to try some yeah. H E double hockey stick hammer? Yeah, I saw you got out to super easy. I can try some tin. I can try like some good, easy, like green pickles again. I can try. I bet the beef hammer will super really be like every single one of the turning birds. So it's combined. Remember, water and milk doesn't really help either. You kind of have to ride it out from here on out. Body experience. It is. Hello. Hello. Hello, Mom. Good go away. Hello. Uh, how long does it last? Probably like 10 to 15 yeah. good cell minutes. Yeah. It's starting to come down maybe a little bit. That's a good thing. Mine's pretty much. Oh, no, I got a little bit of burn. Mine's pretty much down. So maybe. I'm going to add a little bit. Has it been now. 10 or 15 minutes for her? Are you gonna survive it? She's probably coming down by now. A little, a little bit. bit. At least she probably. This is a different burn than um than green sickle. Yes. This got me like <coughs> back of the throat. Yeah, chest. more back of the throat. Well, man, what are you doing? Oh, I feel like throwing up a little bit. Could, that kind of happens sometimes. Oh, I had a back and forth. That's what I'm doing. <sighs> Are you going to survive it? Are you coming down? No. Oh, oh, a little bit. I'm like, All right. I was at like a 10 and I'm like a 9. Okay, so it's coming down a little bit. Should we call her a day? Yeah, maybe. Not as in pain and suffering. She's coming down actually. Survived it, possibly one of the the hottest, or maybe one of the hottest tinctures in the world. One drop, cam person, good job. Doing family building tolerance, awesome sauce. Survived, oh, burn and burn yesterday. Oh, feels okay. oh. All right, you will survive it. Maybe you'll can maybe try. I, I can you get me a bag? Oh, it feels so good. Okay. I'll get you oh dear. Sorry, people. Oh, no. I think I actually have my spew. Oh! It's not hitting my stomach, right? Oh, yeah, make sure this no. Make sure this doesn't have a hole in it. Make oh. sure both of them don't. Maybe. There's two. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. There's two in case. Make sure that it doesn't have a hole in it. Oh, no. Oh, no, don't. Don't puke. Don't. You seriously feel like puking? Uh -huh. yeah. Alright, we are gonna leave. We'll give you an update in the comments if she makes it or not. Yeah. Alright, you've seen Miss Reborn do the landmine and camera person and Miss Reborn do some AG double hockey stick hammer again. Not for your average person. I don't recommend that if you're not chilly head. 
I don't know. I had a moment of insanity. I thought you were going to just make me do a spoonful. But instead, you tried it. Good for you, Cam. <laughs> and we'll see you next time on the Mr. Brad Warden Show. Give it a like and smash that. Wait, give it a like and <laughs> smash. I don't know. Smash Give that subscribe, obviously, if you haven't. Do it for the Cam person. She's part of this crazy journey. And we call it the Mr. Brad Warden Show. And we'll see you next time.